when I look at this and I look at the label and I look at the word sugars, the problem with the labeling system right now is we cannot tell whether or not the word sugars on there is added sugar, meaning did they dump a bunch of white table sugar in there, or is it sugar that naturally comes in the product like milk. So I'm going to give you an example of two nutrition labels. And I want you to kind of look at those and decide, hmm, which one's better for me? <laughs> yeah, what do you think? If, when you're looking at these two labels, what kinds of things, what's the first thing that you go for? Calories, okay? Yeah, everyone's got their own place that they go, right? Anybody else go to something else besides calories? Serving, Serving size. size, very well, a bunch of smarties, good, good, good. Fiber, okay. And so are you, if, if you're looking at fiber, are you thinking, I want more fiber or I want less fiber? Okay, so here's something to know. If you are an athlete, I do not want you to eat a bunch of fiber around when you're about ready to compete. <laughs> <laughs> and the reason why is, you know, a few things, right? But the big thing is that fiber slows down digestion time, which is really good if we want to feel full. But when we want to get food into our system pretty quickly, we don't want to be eating a bunch of fiber. I don't want you to eat three brown muffins and a whole wheat bagel or whatever before you, um, before you go out and compete because it's going to stop up your system, so to speak, right? So I want you to think about actually um, keeping the, the fiber at bay immediately before your performance and immediately after your performance. It doesn't mean that you can't eat brown rice, but it just means don't go crazy. That's not when you want to take like your fiber supplement or something. So when we're comparing these two labels, I love how everyone kind of has their own thing that they look at. I think one of the good things to look at that we kind of forget about is this little section at the bottom here. You know, it says vitamin C is really high in this one, 33% of your daily value, vitamin A, calcium, a little, lots of stuff in there. In this one, there's nothing. This is actually a banana, and this one is actually Starburst. But it's interesting how if we don't have any more information, when we look at the sugars, they are exactly the same. And everyone would agree with me that a banana is better than Starburst, right? Does anyone not agree with me? <laughs> okay. Um, no, but the idea here is that we need more information. And I loved how someone said, hey, I want to I see more. I need to see the ingredient list. So make sure that you don't take a label um, at, at face value, especially when it comes to sugars, because we did not add any sugar to this banana. And sugar is carbohydrate, and carbohydrate is what you're going to use for fuel for your performance, okay?